Hey everyone, so I'm back with another project. Um, this is another uh, collection that I used from the Prima Shabby Chic collection. Um, so I wanted to show you, these are wooden dress forms that um, I decorated. And um, so I'm just going to uh, talk about what I did. So it came um, as a piece of wood. It came like that. So I painted it with the um, crackle paint, the white crackle paint, and I, I painted the whole thing. And then after it dried, then I used Mod Podge uh, so that the crackles uh, wouldn't flake off because I don't know if you've used crackle paint, but it has a tendency to start cracking off after, or flaking off after um, it dries. So um, I didn't want that to happen. So I used the Mod Podge to um, kind of seal it. So, and then I used, um, I took the Shabby Chic Collection, um, the paper, and I just ripped a bunch of strips. And um, then I used the Mod Podge to uh, decoupage it and so that's why there's a bunch of the papers from the collection in there and it's shiny um, because of the Mod Podge and then I used the um, Say It In Crystals from Prima uh, Camelot Flower and then I put a feather back there and then I used the Prima Lace to just kind of make it look like it's a skirt or a dress. And then I used the E-Line Flower and the E-Line Pearls and Crystals. And then I added um, a strip of the Say and Crystals um, to accent the stand. So I made two. Um, one of these is going to Tracy. Um, I was chatting with her on the Scrap Beach and um, she was asking me what I was going to be working on and I told her that I was going to be working on some dress forms so I told her that I would make one for her so um, so one of these are hers so that's the first one here's the second one for this one I did it a little bit different on this one I wanted the wood to show through um, so instead of painting the entire uh, dress form, I just took the crackle paint and just kind of um, ran it over the wood, um, leaving spots that were not painted. So you can see the wood under there also. And that's only on the front and the back. The sides are painted completely. And then again, you can see the different papers from the collection. And then I used the Satan Crystals and put um, the flourishes back there. And then another feather and Camelot flower. Again, I used the lace and I glimmer mist this flower a different color. Um, I wanted to make them a little different. And then another um, flourish. So for this one, the flower is in the middle of the dress form. And this one, it's at the bottom. So Tracy, just message me and let me know which one you like. And I will get that into the mail to you. Um, if you guys would like a tutorial on how I did this, uh, just leave a comment um, or you can message me and um, I can uh, make a video for you guys. Alright, thanks for watching and I hope you like it. Please leave a comment. Let me know how I'm doing. Thanks. Bye.